why your WhatsApp business API display name got rejected. So the display name means the name that you show on your WhatsApp number. And once that display name gets approved, every time you send a bulk message or an individual message using your cloud API, the end customer would be able to see your business name without them saving your number. So they don't have to save your number and they will see your brand name right on their WhatsApp, right? But there are times when your display name gets rejected and you get a message like this. For example, you, you see over here, this, um, this company, uh, you know, is getting a message which says your display name was rejected and let's see what was the reason for it. So Meta has an official guideline on the display name and I'm putting the link to this in the description below. Now let's just discuss so as per Meta's policy, right, if you are trying to use a display name that you want to showcase on your WhatsApp, you need to make sure that the display name accurately represents your brand name. As you can see over here, it's written that your brand name should be accurately displayed. So if your company, let's say, is... Uh, XYZ Private Limited, then the word XYZ or XYZ Private Limited has to be there in the display name, right? Let me just give you an example. If you see over here, Meta says what's accepted is if your company name is Fresh produ Produce Boston, even if there is incorporation or private limited after that, that's absolutely fine. You can, uh, you know, take it off, but you need to put your brand name over here. So we are using the word fresh produce Boston or we are using fresh produce Boston customer service department right or what you know how you can get it approved is fresh produce by global grocers incorporation so if your company is different if you have a different company name then what you got to do is add your brand name followed by your company name for example if you see over here you know, when we say Watchimp by Grumi Organic, Grumi Organic LLC is a US based company. So we have a full name as Grumi Organic LLC, right? And we took out the LLC from here and we're using the word Grumi, uh, Watchimp by Grumi Organic. So you got to make sure that you're using your company's name, right? And if, let's say, you really want to use that brand name, then what you need to do is either verify your uh, business by the correct uh, document that has your you know business name mentioned on it. Let's say you uploaded a business document that does not display that business name, right? So what you got to do is go to your security center. Let me just show you how you go to that. So I'm going to go to this handy links, watchim.com slash links. And then I'm going to go to my... Uh, security center right so i'm just going to click on this i'm just showing you the easiest way to go to the security center now let's just go to one of our company's uh business manager and if you see over here you know you see the business is verified by the name gromi organic llc right so if the business is verified by gromi organic llc then the only name that you can use is gromi organic llc or you can use something like XYZ by Gromi Organic. So what you got to do is you got to create a new Facebook business manager from here. You see over here, this button that says create business portfolio. You need to create a new business portfolio over here and make sure that you verify this business portfolio with the you know company name that you really want to use, right? Or, you know, you can get like a trade certificate or doing business as certificate. You can, you know, use these certificates as well to apply for it and you know try using that name over here so in this case you know uh, you know if you want to correct your mistake and don't want to go ahead and uh, you know create a new business portfolio what I would do is click on the edit button and how I how I came to this uh, you know section again go to watchim.com slash links and then it'll take you to phone numbers. You see this phone number over here. Just click on this and it'll take you to this, right? Now, once you come here, 
go to your edit button right and how did i reach to edit button i clicked on this number then went to profile and click on the edit number and then here you have to uh, input a new display name that follows the guideline of meta and apply for it and it's going to take some time 24 to 48 hours for meta to get back to you and see if you know the new name complies with the uh, meta policy or not once it is complied it's going to give you the approval you can always come back and see if my uh, display name got approved or not all right that's it for today if you have any question drop it down in the comment below i'll be happy to answer and i will see you in the next one Bye bye